Deadman mode Armageddon is here. Every DMM I have played, I've found fun ways to use sigils and mechanics, like hitting over 100 with Darox and dragon spearing players into safe zones. This time is no different, but before I can do anything, I need to grind my account to that stage. One minute till we start and I'm just updating, waiting till one of these worlds shows zero and then we jump in. I'm gonna start off by doing agility to 25 so I can do one of the quests. Just a little lag here, just a little lag. Okay, we got ourselves a starter pack, please give us a sigil, a good sigil. Forager and 5k cat. Okay, that's good. That's good. We got ourselves 25 agility. We can move on to the next thing. First of all, we're gonna destroy this starter bow because that way we can get ourselves another staff in Lumbridge when we go to Lumbridge. We're currently being door jammed. Oh my, there's so many people here. Yeah, I'm hopping to an Aussie world. This is this is not worth waiting. We need to do Monk Commanders 1. That's the goal here. And if we do that quest, we're gonna speed up in combat levels, speed up in brackets. Definitely a quest worth doing. There we go. We suicided to the gnome, so we get a teleport to Lumbridge. Oh, if we talk to this guy we get another starter pack beautiful and another free staff that's really nice and we got ourselves a draymond staff for teleports talk to this npc to set your respawn point to grand exchange all right with this draymond staff we can just teleport around using the fairy ring and this is for the quest line of this grand tree i believe here perfect i've bought my sigil of mobility so that means once i pick it up i can just use unlimited teleports with one law rune. Unlimited run for this Denma mode is just amazing. You can speed through all the quests, no worries at all. Talk to King Bolren and we should complete our first quest here. Let's see, what level do we get from one attack? There we go. 51 attack, 20 combat. We're going back to complete the Grand Tree as well. So we are back here at the Grand Tree. We have the Sigil of Mobility now. We can use unlimited amount of teleports as soon as we get the Varrock teleport unlocked. All right, that's my Black Demon dead. Don't be a bug where one of these attacks me, thank you. All right, this is our second quest completed. How many levels do we get? 48 agility, 60 attack. Okay, I'm just gonna suicide because that's quicker than getting through that door downstairs. Okay, six bones. That's all I have, please be enough. Nah, I got 35. Alright, it's fine, it's fine. We got five more bones. We're back, still on protection, so no one can PK us. No, I still got... I only got 41. Four Lava Dragon Bones, if this is not enough, I'm logging off and quitting dead my mode. Oh my, and th these last for so lo long. Oh my god, I got 47. And we're looking pretty good so far. One minute left on the protection, 33 combat. Overhead prayers, two quests done, and good stats. Okay, running all the way here with the one prayer point left was kind of scary, but we did it. While waiting for this gorilla, I'm just gonna... All right, now we just wait for a little gnomes here to kill the jungle demon for me. The upcoming two weeks, I will be playing dead man mode from when I wake up to when I go to bed. I have prepared a bunch of food, actually my mom prepped it. I have finished all my chores and gotten myself the best PC I have ever owned. Yep, this is Starforge Systems. The makers of the best PCs in the universe is here with a limited edition PC build inside of an old school RuneScape case. The design of this thing is actually amazing, just look at that. It's art. Starforge offers several PCs all at different price points so you can get the PC that's right for you. Every computer comes with a full two year parts and labor warranty so you're covered no matter what. Starforge got a great deal on the limited edition old school PC. It comes with a 12 month old RuneScape membership and all six plate lights. But if you want you can just grab the RuneScape case by itself or have it as an upgrade to the Navigator or Voyager systems. The specs on these PCs are amazing while simultaneously looking incredible. If you're looking to get yourself a PC upgrade then I highly recommend Starforge PC. Check out the link in the description for the best PC on the market, grab yourself the limited edition old school RuneScape PC or just the case. And thank you again to Starforge for sponsoring today's video. Is that the kill? <gasps> no I died! That is Monkey Madness 1. Complete, we get 10k GP and 3 diamonds, but we're not gonna get the XP reward just yet. Um, we're gonna do waterfall to get our stats as high as possible. And we should get a lot of levels right here. 53 strength, 64 attack. So we are almost about to get ourselves protection. The breach starts in 17 minutes. So since the breach starts in 7 minutes, I decided to complete Children of the Sun in case the breach is there. I believe no one has done this quest either. There you are, Dario, give me the reward. Oh, 78 combat. We jumped two brackets for Wiggle World 403. 4 to 4 people is over there. 
we're gonna unlock Desert Treasure 1 for the Ancient Spellbook. I wanna have a Crystal Shield, Crystal Bow, and... Uh, and Zora unlocks, we unlock that as well. Nice. The first Deadman mode breach has begun. This is where big bosses spawn and you can get big loot from these. Look at us all with <laughs> starter staffs. Is that water strike? There's so many people here. Rune plate legs, nice. It's actually Duriel. Look at him. Oh, he can't mage this guy. You gotta melee him. <gasps> oh yes, pair of rune plate legs. Now I think I can afford uh, a D skim. Chaos rune, oh. Chaos runes are really nice. Please guys, help me feed my family by subscribing. Thank you. I'm very happy with the breach. I got plenty of rune plate legs, chaos rune supplies. And there we have it. We have the dragon scimitar after the breach. That's Varrock Museum done. Wilderness Slayer task. I'm gonna do that for the rest of the protection. 35 minutes left. Hellhounds. Oh, I think you can collect XP from this girl as well. Yep, we got 10k mining experience. Not many people know you can collect XP from Information Clerk. I will use the XP on prayer. That's 30k XP on prayer. We got 50 now. Here we go. Give us some supply drops and Laren's keys. Oh, yes. We got a tier 5. Another tier 5 and Wilderness Crabs teleport. So two archaic emblems for 3 million points. We're gonna buy prey pots for now. Four minutes left under protection while risking my entire bank. It's the D skim. Good luck. Okay, we got nothing. But this strange icon is giving us 200k prey experience. So let's run back. There is a peek here. Okay, I'm gone. I got the lamp. 300k prayer experience 64 prayer now that i completed that barrels and got 64 prayer i can use chivalry we're gonna bank every time we get a tier 5 all right 55 magic we can start high alking uh, while training magic oh my god i i'm farming these tier 5s i'm abusing the emblem trader store we're gonna buy we got 5 million points we're gonna buy surge sacks ancient sacks that we can sell for money and nature runes so we can keep high alking we're gonna get ourselves a quick little magic upgrade here. The cape. I will, no one's ever gonna be here, so. And we got ourselves the capes. We now have 70 magic. We can start barraging and get our magic up even quicker. Oh, Laren's key. Okay, there's just too many people here. Like, look at that. I'm never gonna be able to get the dragon defender efficiently, so I think I'm just gonna kill this and leave. All right, give me money. I want money. Dragon arrow tips? That's like the one item I can't sell. I need to high out that. <gasps> He's not on protection. Wait, he can't leave her? Oh, this is great. This man got no escape. Oh no. At least he got the gap here. Oh, they're running <laughs> and our boy is dead. Oh, wait, there we go. He's dead. That's good fight. That's a lot of nature runes, a lot of money. Oh, 88k. Look at the looting bag. Okay, we made money there. So we are looking good right now. Ah, oh, nothing in the chest. Okay, we bought ourselves an ancient staff. All right, we got ancients on defensive. This should be very quick defensive and magic experience. Oh, there we go. 82 magic. We are done here. We can ice blitz. And that is 50 construction. We can now make ourselves the teleport chamber in our house. Good for escapes. Good for basic teleports. Is someone AFK here? Tata Dog Lord. He's trying to get a freeze escape on me. In multi. Is that full elder? <gasps> That's huge. What? He had so much runes. What is this PK? He had a glory. Oh my god. I gotta hide. Where do I go? Look at this peak. 700 rat runes, 18 barrel stabs. 850k, 500k in Rue. Oh, that's a good key, actually. 300k for Elder Top, 105k for the Hood, 150k. I'm, 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 I'm feasting right now. Okay, we got ourselves a Carol's Letter Skirt just for the deposit box. All right, with that PK, we can finally afford our portal chamber. 100k, 
gun. The puzzle box looking kind of alright. Uh, Carol's red skirt, black d height, ancient staff. So in case I die, I do have a lot of backup items. So I just can go straight back out there. Alright, we got a breach in Varlamor and I believe not many people have completed this quest. So we're just running to singles. Oh my, everyone's doing the quest right now. Oh my, there's so much loot on the ground. Give me something. Blood runes, 500 of them. Plenty of loot so far. Let's go with a DSIM. I have to go rogue. Piss off, it says. He got no escape. He's just kneeling and he's called up. How much food does this guy have? Good fight. There's a DSIM. It was worth it, I believe. A DSIM is always worth a PK. Ooh, cash. Love to see it. I've been AFKing rock crabs for a long time and that's 70 range. Full black D hide, full mystics. We are ready to go up to the next combat bracket. We got some plants over there. A lot more PVMing and PKing. So I'll see you in a few days for the next episode. I think he's panicking because he's hitting the entangle when he I'm freezing him. Is that Pimpact? You're not getting a split from that. Oh, 5-8 difference. Oh, we got crystal weapons. That's worth nothing. And that's... Uh, it's alright. 